Hey what's up guys, Hacksplain here. Today we're going to have a look at the upload size challenge. Now, the description says we should upload a file which is larger than 100 kilobytes. And this falls under the improper input validation challenges. So let's scroll up a little bit and see where we do have an upload functionality. And I actually already scouted the website a little bit and I found that under the complaint section over here we can upload an invoice and there's a browse button right over here. So let's try to upload a file. I'm having a file over here which is called doc1pdf. I'll put down a message saying ASDF, it doesn't really matter. I'll submit this and yep we are getting a message saying customer support will get in touch with you soon. Your complaint reference is number two. And if we have a look at that, we see that there was a post request going out to slash file minus upload. And you can see the PDF upload right down below here. So all that red stuff is the PDF that I was sending to the web server. And you can see over here that I was sending an application PDF content type. So what happens if I send a file which is a little bigger? So now I'm trying to send a file which is bigger than 100 kilobytes, as you can see over here. And the client side controls right now actually only allow me to upload a file which has a maximum of 100 kilobytes. So what can we do in order to circumvent the client side controls? That's pretty easy. We go back to Burp. We're still having this request open that is needed to upload a file. We click on Control R to send this request to our repeater. We check out repeater. We can send this again just to check if it still works. It does and it responds with a 204 no content response. So instead of sending this file right now, which is smaller than 100 kilobytes, let's try to send one which is bigger. So I'm going to open up Notepad right now and open the, the bigger PDF file in Notepad and copy it straight into Burp's repeater. All right, so you can see that I'm having doc2 PDF open in Notepad. And it basically looks like a lot of garbage because Notepad cannot render a PDF file. But what we can do is we can just copy all the information, all the data, and move over here to Burp's repeater. And now we get to substitute all that information which we find over here. So I'm scrolling down to the very bottom of the request. And if we're finished, which will happen in just a bit, right now we will delete that and fill in our new content so now i'm uploading a file which is bigger than 100 kilobytes now we'll just go ahead and click on send and what we see over here is that we're receiving a 204 no content response once again which kind of means that the file was uploaded and if we check back to os shop we can see that we've successfully solved the challenge which is upload size upload a file larger than 100 kilobytes so that was it for today so you should have learned that you should never trust client side controls as a company or if you're on the attacker side make sure to circumvent client side controls by using a tool like burp suite all right thank you for watching Subscribe in the top right corner and yeah, check out all my other videos.